thanks for tuning in to Measures of Success Video Practice Buddy Series. I'm Dr. Deb. In this session, we're going to show you the best way to assemble and disassemble your trumpet. It's really pretty easy. I'd like you to meet Will. Here's Will. And Will's going to help us to demonstrate today while I take you through the process. As you can see, Will hasn't yet taken his trumpet out of the case yet. He's going to show you how to do that in the safest way possible. If you do what Will does, your trumpet won't become damaged when you take it out of the case. So the first thing he's done is he, he's placed his case on the floor, so you should do that too. You can do that on the floor on a sturdy table. Will will make sure that the case is not upside down. Your case might look different from this, but usually there's a logo of some kind on the side of the case that should be on top, not on the bottom. Can you point your logo out to them, Will? There it is, right there. Good. If your case doesn't have a logo on it, you should check out the latches. If the case is in the correct position for opening, the latches should open up, should lift up. And that's what, what uh, Will's doing right there. Great. So, if you think you're going to forget, another thing you can do would be to put a really cool sticker on top of the, uh, the case, and then you won't forget. So now that the case is uh, in the right position, Will's going to open it up for you. And now, go ahead and open the, the nice blanket that's covering his trumpet. You might not have that in your case, but Will has it in his case. And he's going to show you the best way to take the trumpet out of the, uh, the case. So he's going to take both hands, and he's going to lift the trumpet out of the case with both hands. So let's take a look at how he does that. See how carefully he did that? So that's exactly what you should do. Take it out of the case with both hands. Now that Will's taken the trumpet out of his case, he's going to take the mouthpiece out of the case. So go ahead and take the mouthpiece in his right hand. And he's going to take the, the mouthpiece and insert the shank into the mouthpiece receiver pipe. He's going to do it very gently. And when he puts it, he's going to give it a tiny, tiny little bit of a twist. And what happens is, when you give it a twist, the shank is grabbed by the inside of the receiver pipe. And he just did that very nicely. So a couple things you need to remember. Don't bang on the mouthpiece and don't twist too hard. So that's it. Assembling a trumpet is really easy and so is the disassembly. All you need to do is reverse the procedure. So watch Will. He's going to take the mouthpiece out. He's going to give it a tiny little twist while he's pulling it straight out. And then he's going to put it back in the correct spot in the case. Very good. Then he's going to grab the trumpet with both hands. He's going to return it back to the case, making sure to put it in exactly the right spot. When everything is in the correct spot, he can close the case. So go ahead and close that, Will, and make sure that it's locked. Well, thanks for that great demonstration. That was really good. The next Measures of Success Video Practice Buddy series focuses on posture, hand position, and embouchure for the trumpet. So check that out. On behalf of all the folks here at FJH Music and Will, I'm Dr. Deb. Thanks for joining us.